Hello, learners. Now here we are given that ABC are angles of a triangle and we need to show that sine 2A plus sine 2B minus sine 2C is 4 cos A cos B sine C. Okay. Fine. So since ABC are angles of a triangle, okay, A plus B plus C is equal to pi 180 degrees because sum of angles in a triangle is 180 degrees. Okay. That's going to be my first step. Now, uh, let me start with the LHS and prove that this is going to be equal to the RHS. Okay. This is my LHS sin 2A plus sin 2B minus sin 2C. Now I'm going to group the first two terms. Okay. Group them means basically I want to apply a formula to these two terms. Now, what is that? Uh, I think you're familiar with sin C plus sin D, right? See sin C plus sin D is 2 sin C plus D by 2 cos C minus D by 2. Okay. So basically I'm going to apply it on these two terms in place of C and D here we have 2A and 2B. So here we have 2 sin 2A plus 2B by 2 cos 2A minus 2B by 2 and minus sin 2C. It's as it is. Okay. Now here if you'll observe 2, 2 would get cancelled within the bracket. Here also 2, 2 would get cancelled. I will have to 2 sin A plus B cos A minus B minus sin 2C. Okay. Now. Uh, here we know that a plus b plus c is equal to pi. Okay. So basically a plus b would be equal to pi minus c. Okay. If you send c to the other side, you would get a plus b is pi minus c. That's what I'm going to use. So here 2 sin a plus b is going to be 2 sin pi minus c into cos a minus b minus sin 2c. Okay. Uh, now why did this happen? Mention the reason like this. Okay. It's important. Okay. So that, you know, invigilator would not have any chance to detect marks. Okay. I mean the examiner. Not the English later, I'm sorry. So here. Uh, and sine pi minus theta is sine theta. So you get sine 2 sine c cos a minus b. And sine 2 c is 2 sine c cos c. Okay. Because sine 2 a is 2 sine a cos a. Okay. Next. Uh, in these two terms, I'm going to take 2 sine c as common. If I'll do so, I'd be left out with 2 sine c into cos of a minus b minus cos c. Now. I, I'm, I want to write this C in terms of A plus B. Okay. So what do I have? A plus B plus C is pi. So if I'll keep C here and send A plus B to the other side, I'd be getting C as pi minus of A plus B. Okay. So basically this would be nothing but 2 sin C into cos of A minus B minus cos pi minus of A plus B. Okay. Now what is cos of pi minus theta? It's minus cos theta. So here we have uh, cos of pi minus of a plus b. This would be nothing but minus cos a plus b. Here already one minus is there. So minus into minus would be plus. And hence I'd get two sine. Okay. Again, don't forget to mention the reason Okay, that, uh, you know, c is pi. Since a plus b plus c is pi, c would be nothing but pi minus of a plus b. It's always important whenever you come across that such steps to mention the reason. Now, uh, as I mentioned, this would be nothing but uh, plus 2 sin c into cos of a minus b plus cos a plus b as I had already explained. Now cos of a minus b plus cos of a plus b is nothing but 2 cos a cos b. Okay. 2 cos a cos b. And you need to mention that. Okay. And here 2 sin c into 2 cos a cos b. That's it. We are nearing the end. Just multiply 2 to the 4 and arrange them in a, b, c, y. So we have 4 cos a cos b sin c. That's it. Look at the top of the screen. This is what we had to prove and we have proved it. Thank you. In case you like this uh, video solution, please hit the like button. And if this is your first thing coming across my channel, please just subscribe to it. Not just that, you know, I've done many more questions, uh, you know, based on uh, trigonometry. You will find the playlist uh, link in the description. So please do check it out. Okay. Don't forget. Thank you.